So the goal for this assignment is to fix this guy's face. Notice his eye and his nose. They're not looking so great. So I'm going to copy the image, go into Photoshop, File, New, and Image from the Clipboard. Once I copy something, it's on the clipboard, so I can simply just put it here. So here it is. Now it's a 61.9%. If I want to, I can zoom into it, or oof, plus, zoom into it. So it's at 100%, and then I can make all these little changes I need to make. Well, the first thing I'm going to do here is I'm going to do a nice little trick where I can actually just take this side of his face. I'm going to go to Edit and Copy, and then I simply go to Edit and Paste. And there it is. You'll notice right here another layer of his face, right? I'm going to take this end, and I'm going to copy it over here so that it simply is a mirror image of the right side. I can put it where I want it, down here somewhere. Um, if I make the opacity slightly less, I can kind of see through it. See how I can see through it there? And then that will help me match it up just a little bit better. If I can make his mouth lined up there. I'm going to put the opacity up, and I'm going to take a eraser tool. I'm going to make it a little bit thin. Uh, and I'm going to just erase around the edges here. Now we definitely need to fix his nose. Now this is a before and this is it after. So you can see we've just simply stuck that eye on. If we want to, we can move it lower. I'm going to go ahead and play with his nose now. I'm going to search for a guy's nose that might be similar. So maybe let's try Zac Efron. You can choose any person you want. I'm just choosing Zac Efron because I figure he has kind of a similar nose here. Let's go ahead and find a large image. Maybe. Click on full size image. Paste it. I'm now going to take this selection tool. I'm going to select here. Just like before, I'm going to go copy and then paste. Now I have Zek Efron's little piece of his nose here, as you can see, and I don't need what's behind it, so I'm just going to trash it, drag it to the trash, and there it is. Now I have this guy. I can turn the opacity down a little bit so that I can see through. Have the mouth kind of you got to make sure you get the face just right, pretty close there. Then you're going to take the eraser tool. You're going to erase around. You're going to erase his mouth, erase his eyes there. You're going to turn the opacity back up, of course, so you have the full nose. If you need to, to angle it slightly, move it slightly, whatever you need to do, that's fine. Now you're going to notice that there's a color problem with his nose here. So you can go to Enhance, Adjust Color, and you're going to adjust the hue saturation. Now Change the hue here. We'll maybe pull the saturation down a touch. And make it so it just kind of fits the same color as the rest of his face there. And then just save it as face. Save it as face and then put it in the format of PNG or JPG. It's up to you. I'm going to go ahead and do PNG. And save it in your student number file web design folder and save click OK and you're good